craving for lamb chop, lamb grill, but the price is too pricey? Well, have you guys found out about this one hidden gem for all Kambing Perak lovers? Shafika Alia Binti Wamazwin and I am the founder of Ikan Bakar Pork Budu. Kambing Perak Pork Budu is originated from a famous restaurant in Dungan which is Ikan Bakar Pork Budu and Western Pork Budu which they are famous with their siakap spooner ringgit and its most loved black pepper sauce which make the locals addicted with the food there. Kambing Perak Pork Budu uses only halal premium Australian lamb shoulder which are marinated well with the secret marinade from Western Pork Budu which make the lamb to remain tender and juicy after being cooked. You guys must be thinking, Australian lamb shoulder part? It must be not that cheap. Hmm. How can ten ringgit is not that cheap for a marinated premium Australian lamb shoulder? Yes, you hear me right. The price is only ten ringgit for a pack of 150 gram kambing perak pot budu. Crazy, right? But it is. If pot budu can sell siakap that worth 10,000 somewhere else at only 10 ringgit. How can he cannot sell this premium marinated lamb shoulder at 10 ringgit too? Kambing Perak Pot Budu is available at 3 range of sizes and retail prices which is 10 ringgit for 150 gram, 20 ringgit for 300 gram and 33 ringgit for 500 gram. It's worth it. I am currently supplying the Kambing Perak Pot Budu to frozen and grocery stores in Dungun, Kuala Terengganu, Marang, and Setiu by consignment. The distributed price is given at 8 ringgit and 50 cent for 150 gram, 18 ringgit for 300 gram, and 30 ringgit for 500 gram. The purpose for me choosing to supply Kambing Perak Pot Budu to frozen and grocery stores instead of selling them to the consumers directly is because I want to widen my circle of network with the distributors around Terengganu so that I can easily expand my business in the future. Approaching distributors to be part of the consignment business is not that easy. Some of the distributors don't even want to hear explanation and reject the opportunity. In order to gain their trust to have our products being placed at their stores, the process requires a good communication skills and bargaining skills. And I also need to offer them the service where I will come to their stores and check the stocks every week or maybe once in two weeks so that I can always keep track with their distributors. Having this commitment while I'm studying is super difficult. I need to manage my time properly and always remind myself that the commitment I'm having right now is for a better connection and networking for me to expand my business in the future. <laughs> 